You need to change these settings now. In order to boost FPS for gaming and performance, disabling it can improve FPS and, and lower input delay. So, if you're new here, hit that subscribe button for more content. Let's dive into the video. Access system configuration and set cores to a higher value to potentially boost gaming performance and FPS so follow me. Access services and disable the sysmain service to potentially enhance gaming performance and FPS, so follow me. Access my Discord server and download the FPS Boost Pack from the provided link in the description to potentially improve gaming performance and FPS. And we're gonna be starting off by disabling the GPU energy driver. So merge it hit yes, and then go ahead and hit OK. It's basically a useless driver that's running. So, we're gonna be disabling Then disable network throttling, which will give you a bit of improvement in your ping. But not a lot, but is still worth it. Then disable the process mitigation. Right click on it, run it as administrator, and then just let it go ahead and disable all of the process medications. Once it has been done, you can go ahead and press any key to continue. Then right click on the vnix.badge and run it as administrator. This is basically um, Badge do EQR. It was developed by Vnix. So, welcome to the 2.0 beta of Vnix. And then it shows you your username. And what you need to do is press 1, and then press enter to apply all of the registration. Three tweaks. Now the reason I'm not doing because it. it's going to flicker the screen. And I'm recording. So, I cannot do that. Once you are done with that, you can go ahead and type in 2, and then press enter. So that it applies the network tweaks, which will tremendously help you with lowering your bing. And once you're done with that, you can apply the GEEPS registry, which will again, give you a huge improvement in your ping. Then for 4 booster, and 5 for about, which will basically take you to the distort server. But once you have applied all of the tweaks inside of this optimizer, after applying the optimizer tweak, access Windows settings and implement the recommended settings to potentially enhance gaming performance and FPS. After setting the display to 100%, adjust your monitor to the highest refresh rate available to potentially improve gaming performance and FPS. Disable the focus assist settings and go to power settings. To set the power plan to high performance, potentially enhancing gaming performance and FPS. access storage settings and clear temporary files to potentially improve gaming performance and FPS. After making optimizations, restart your PC to potentially improve gaming performance and FPS. <laughs> 